Welcome back, everyone. You may be wondering how you can go ahead and transfer your messages, your text messages, from your Android phone to your iPhone. Now, there's really only one way to do this, and there may be some other applications that you can download on your PC or your Mac or whatever to actually go ahead and do this. But if you don't want to, you know, intrude yourself and have to do that, the only way to do this for the most part is to install this application called Move to iOS from your Android and pretty much download it on your iPhone as well. And then you'll be, and then you'll pretty much be able to transfer your everything from your Android to your specific iPhone. Now, from there, you can delete whatever else you want to from your device. But for the most part, this is one of the easier ways to do it. So all you'll have to do is pretty much on both phones, you want to scroll over to your app store on your Android, and you want to download this Move to iOS specific app on your specific, you know, Android. So this is going to be a basic app, and all you have to do at that point is get your iPhone into essentially restore mode. So essentially you'll come into a page like this and you'll be able to pretty much detect and you know figure out what data you want to transfer. So when you do that, it's going to say easily move all your photos, messages, contacts, and more. And after you go and install this application, you'll see this process. And then it'll go ahead and give you the process to do this. You want to go and click continue. And then after it's done being you know ported over, it'll say, hey, the transfer is complete. Do you want to whatever, right? And then you'll see on your iPhone that you'll actually have that specific information of your on your specific device. And it's a really easy process. It doesn't take too much time, but that's really the main way to transfer your messages. There's other ways you can copy those messages to your SIM card and input them to your SIM card. But for the most part, that's really the only way to do it is by using the Move to iOS application. So. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, Zotland.